All right, I put a poll up, boys. Are we gonna do Bear or Yusek? Cast your votes. The goal is level 42 and uh, Max Raiders. Do we have any name suggestions? You're finished. <laughs> I like that one, actually. Uh, yeah, I'm just bored on my main account. I got my uh, Kappa, so... Playing just for PvP is... It gets boring after like an hour or so. Alright, if we don't get any other name suggestions, we're gonna go with your finished. Do we go with two ends or one? One is better, I guess, right? Are we gonna go with this, your finished? And looks like we're gonna go with Usek. 71% wanted Usek. I'm very surprised. I thought we were gonna go Bear. We go with Grant. He looks like he knows what's up. What the fuck am I doing here? What the fuck am I doing here? Alright, so... They changed the traders, so everything is inspected. So we can't do the inspections and, and get level 2 anymore. So that fucking sucks. But I'm gonna start off by selling all the garbage. Because I am very limited on space, as you guys know, standard accounts. Stash base is very tiny. If this was early wipe, I would probably keep them for, but... Not today. And we're gonna do the good old... Mosin. Because <laughs> we need to get level 3 sniping for uh, Tarkov Shooter Part 4, I believe. I'm not going to do the reloading because ain't nobody got time for that. But Mozin can uh, one-tap everyone in the brain, no matter what you're wearing, basically. Alright, so. I think I'm going to hop into Woods, trying to get some Celebos. need to accept my quest as well. Uh, the patient can go fuck himself. Alright, we got a decent spawn for... Uh, Finding Salewas. So our, our only goal this raid is to get level 2. If we can get some um, stuff for quests like like a Salewa or something, that's going to be huge. Or a Lydix, for sure. I'll take a Lydix. I have to get used to uh, level 1 and... Level 1 Endurance and Strength. Jaeger note. I don't have level 2 yet, so I don't have introduction unlocked. You cannot inspect stuff anymore in the beginning. Actually, got a Salewa. This is huge. Up toe is pretty big as well. Cigarettes for mechanic. I'm very uh, afraid that I'm gonna run into someone with some really juicy guns, you know. Yeah, I need the sausage for Jaeger task, indeed, indeed. But uh, it has to be found in raid anyway, so I'm gonna keep it in. Uh, I think it has to be found in raid. I don't like the push here at all. Everything is super slow right now.
I think I need soap for hideout. I think I need it for lavatory. I'm not a hundred on that. I think it's in between the beds, which I checked. Right, I think it's uh, this is good good enough actually. Um, just gonna dip. Get a couple of stashes on my way out. If I can stay alive with the Salewa, that's gonna be huge, actually. I'm hoping to find like decent armor from uh, these stashes. <laughs> Anything better than Pukka goes a long way and uh, misclicking is not fun. me some body armor uh, I'll take the nades I think the AK will go uh, for a couple extra bucks I think it's dead. I don't think it's dead. But they're also changing the stashes and stuff. Stashes are gonna be random and weapon boxes are gonna be random every raid or something. Like this. I don't want to push that at all. I think I'm going to have to go around because I don't want to run into him. I have no aim. <laughs> the fuck? You always want to tap the bodies for extra XP. As you can see, I got 98 extra XP there. Just because I clicked on the body. The shack always has decent loot. This pick up some of this stuff. Uh, the suppressors and stuff like that, they go for decent money. The traders. And I, I like to drink pretty much everything I can, drink and eat everything. Just for uh, metabolism, XP. The m more you level that up, the more you actually have to eat and drink in the, in the raid. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, we should have enough for level 2 now. Hey, RHM, what's up, bro? Alright, we got level 2, so we're chilling. Plus, we got a Salewa, which is huge. Very good. So, next raid, I need 
four scab kills and a Jaeger letter. Alkali will need four Spator, I believe. Cigarettes for uh, yeah. whatever the task is just for cigarettes. I'll keep this stuff for now. I'm, I can't remember everything off the top of my head that I uh, I'm gonna need for my hideout and my quests. So. Plus, I cannot keep every single item anyway. I think I need vitamins for med station at some point. And now we can get gunsmith and introduction. That's actually a pretty good spawn. Um, I'm gonna hit the med camp first. Maybe get a couple of scavs. Maybe a couple of salewos. And then uh, hit the note on my way out. I should have brought cash for uh, car extract. I forgot about that. Give me my nuts. I do have some awesome Finnish friends. Spun is the only friend I have from Finland. I don't think I need any more soap. We're chilling on the uh, soap department. The pro is good. Need Iscross for Jaeger. That's pretty good. Stuff is just good money. All right, cool. I wanna always headshot the scavs if I can. Did he just tank a bullet in the face? That bro is tanking, man. My brain power is non-existent, boys. <laughs> God damn. Yeah, I'm going back for the thing. Seal, man. Seal. Bro, I am so used to dropping, like, basic meds that I do need uh, where was that Hopefully that fella over there has a toss. Take this. And check for some uh, Salewas over here. This guy is in such a bad spot. Please have a toss. No, okay. We got 10k rubles though. That's bank. Alright, let's get the Jaeger letter. 
I'm thinking vehicle extract, yeah, but I'm not. I haven't decided yet. But I think if I don't get a uh, scab kill around here, then I'm definitely going vehicle. Yeah. Because I'm uh, most likely gonna. Yep, I'm going vehicle. I'm not gonna run towards any shots unless I really have to. So get the notes. Get my last one or two scabs, whatever I need for proper in the village and extra. If it's still there, actually, I should probably. Seems like it's still there. Oh, if it's if it's red, it means it's taken. Um, if there's a chance that the car extract might not spawn, it's gonna have question marks behind it, kind of like the uh, ZBO14 has. But uh, on on woods, it spawns 100% of the time, or uh, the car extract is there 100% of the time, every single raid. The door's closed, so it looks like there's no players around. I'm hoping to find a all and eat that bastard. Or something, I can't remember what it was, but I, I know I need it for hideout. And it was painful to find early wipe. I'll need the MREs for uh, humanitarian supplies. Very bad shot, but we did it. Debut is completed, or one subtask at least. Mother. Right, that was a good one. Let's go. It's uh, very important that we kill every scout with headshot if possible, as you can see. Headshots gave us more XP than uh, the actual kills themselves, which is kind of weird. I think they've reduced the uh, the XP, because I think you used to get 200 per kill. Let's hand in the letter. Um, buy the shotguns from them. If you're doing this early wipe and... You can buy the shotguns, buy them immediately. Because uh, they're gonna be out of stock insistently for a long time. I forgot to buy them this wipe on my first chance and uh, it was pretty annoying. But that's uh, two tasks done, so let's go. I still get confused uh, on some of the wood spawns after 3000 hours, it's weird. It is very weird. I do wish that we could get some Salewa stuff. It's good ammo. Uh, the raids feel okay, I guess. Sometimes it gets really quiet. It depends on the day usually. Or the time of day, I mean. Alright, I'm gonna run to the med camp because I... Would like at least something. Some progress somewhere. Check some stashes as well, maybe get... Get a Salewa in there. I don't like it. Oh, someone looted this. Question is, which way is he looting towards?
good chance they left something behind, like cigarettes. He's been leaving cigarettes behind. Oh. I think he's right in front of me. I heard him jump. Or fall off or something. Really hoping he's gonna loot that crate. But he's dropping to the uh He's dropping down there, so I'm not gonna peek over the hill. I'm gonna go towards my med camp. Moment of truth. It's been looted. Please get a Salewa. How many fucking hits are you tanking, bro? <laughs> what the fuck? What, what was he wearing, bro? It was a scav player too, bro. I right, got the same spawn as last time. I believe. Yep. Who <laughs> saw would be amazing. Ask and Nikita sh shall uh, give you what you ask. What? You know, I don't, I'm not even gonna loot the rest of this, bro. I'm just gonna take the edge of the map and I'm gonna bounce. This is a huge find. Did you do scab runs too? Uh, I'll be doing some scab runs, yeah. But generally, I, I don't like to do too many scab runs. If it's... If I'm locked behind, like, a uh, quest item to get some progress, let's say I need, I don't know, one Iskra or something, I might scab into interchange, maybe. Or, like, one to Shanka or something. I should be able to get some uh, scavs at the scav house to get enough XP for extraction. Because I cannot afford to get a uh, run through. I will lose both of my Salewas. Or... The founder raid status will be lost. To be precise. I don't want to kill them for XP. Open for a toss. I didn't see what gun he had. But I'm pretty sure we have enough XP now to just get out of here. Plus, it's gonna be 7 minutes in the raid and 50 seconds anyway. Alright, this was a huge raid. Let's go, boys. Two Stalewas. The last two that we needed. That is a very, very good raid. Right, let's give this in. 
Thank you again for watching, my friends. I really hope you enjoyed the first episode. If you have any feedback, leave it in the comments. Other than that, I hope you have a great day. Take care.